Good evening. Is this better? <laughs> that was Duke Ellington, Duke's place. And we're going to play some good jazz history tonight, all right? We ain't got to guess what we're playing. Y'all going to know the tunes we're doing, all right? If you don't know, by the time we finish it, you will know. <laughs> now you know. <laughs> I'm letting him talk. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm from Brooklyn, New York. So, oh, thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you. So in Brooklyn, that's what they do. You walk in <laughs> about 30 minutes before you play, and you just call tunes, and the audience love it. So we're going to play a tune by a uh, uh, great saxophonist for many years, the great uh, Stanley Tarantino. This is entitled Sugar. Y'all don't know Sugar? You will. <laughs> I got to talk to it, but I don't know how to turn it off. Turn it off. <laughs> yeah, exactly.
How'd you like that one? Is that right? Okay. Thank you. You're welcome. So right now, right now we're going to slow things down and do a feature of our trumpet player, Mr. Mark Rack. He's going to play a lovely ballad. This, is, this one's entitled My Ideal. My Ideal. Not that one. <laughs> He's playing there because we rode five hours from Columbia, South Carolina. So, so he real tired. So I said, you want to play something slow? He said, yeah. So my idea. Not that idea. <laughs>
Mr. Mark Rapp. My idea. Mark. So what we're gonna play now is what musicians call New Orleans the Latin tinge. And we're gonna play a tune by the great Joe Henderson entitled Recorder Me. Check this out.
tells me what he wants to play next week, and he says, it's up to, you, up to me. I had to set all planned out. But I always go by him, because he's playing trumpet. That's very important. So, scratch what I want to do. <laughs> what are you going to do? What, what do you want to play? We can talk about it. We can discuss. We can talk about it. We can come to a compromise. We're going to do Duke Ellington's Caravan. How about that? Oh, yeah. <laughs> That's not what I thought about, but I will do that. <laughs>
Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, lions and tigers and bears, oh my. We certainly hope you had a great time tonight. On the drums, Mr. Justin Barnes on the drums. The great Kevin Smith on the bass. He's all about that bass, no treble. On the complicated beauty that is the piano and is the man. Mr. Kevin Bales on the piano. Kevin Bales. Here's truly Mark Rapp on the trumpet and the flugelhorn. Thank you, thank you. On the alto saxophone. <laughs> Please give a, a loving round of applause to the great Wes Warm Daddy Anderson. Yeah, you're right. Yes, indeed. Hey, thank y'all so much. Hey, y'all should stick around. We're going we're gonna to play another set. So, you know, stick around. Do what you got to do. Stick around. We'd love to have you. Thank y'all so very much. We appreciate you. Y'all are a wonderful audience. And a beautiful audience, too. So, thank you. Y'all have a great weekend. Better week. We love you. Thank you.
welcome to another fabulous night at the Velvet Note! Let me introduce you to the true master of ceremonies, Justin Barnes! I don't know what to say after that. Hopefully, most of you have been to this club before and have seen the great Tamara Fuller and her velvet note. It sounds something like that, but... But more... Uh, definitely lasts a lot longer, right? Okay, so uh, my name is Justin Barnes. I'm the musical director here at the Velvet Note. We have a very, very special uh, uh, group up here tonight. I'm very honored to be playing drums with them. Uh, but uh, I want to introduce quickly the uh, the rhythm section back here, kind of holding it all together. Uh, the best Tamara Fuller Velvet Note Impressionist ever, also a pianist, Mr. Kevin Bales. <laughs> My partner in crime back here, shoveling coal in the rhythm section with me, bassist Mr. Kevin Smith. Uh, I told the story to, to the first crowd. So when we were, uh, when this club first opened, we, I was here the very first night, the very first weekend when Tamara opened the club about 10 years ago. And our very first musical artist was Mr. Mark Rapp. We played two sets. We had three people the whole night, three people. And we enjoy, hey, listen, we had fun. We had fun, but it was, it was humble beginnings to what, what we can do now. Mark uh, spent a lot of time in New Orleans. He spent a lot of time in New York. He's over in Columbia, South Carolina, now doing great work with a jazz organization there that he founded and that he basically runs, like 24 seven he runs it. It's called Cola Jazz. So if you all are ever in Columbia, South Carolina, look up Cola Jazz. As part of that, He'll bring some very, very special guests to our area, and we get to benefit from that, and tonight is no different. Mark has asked his great friend and one of my favorite saxophonists in the entire world, please help me welcome Mr. Wessel Warm Daddy Anderson!
entitled Bye Bye Blackbird. So right now, I'm a great fan of Duke Ellington. How about you? So I'm going to venture off and play one of his, one of his many favorites. This one was entitled In a Mellow Tone in a very slow environment. I'm gonna give it to y'all. You're gonna hear me. I'm giving. I'm gonna give them a question. I'm gonna start on the four chord, so you know who I am. <laughs> Not that I need to tell them. I'm just saying that.
Stay with Duke Ellington for a minute. We don't get enough of him. So we're gonna find out. I'm gonna ask you a question. What's the quickest way to get to Harlem? A train. There you go. There you go. There you go. There you go. That's where we go. All right. <laughs>
Thank you. 
Mr. Mark Rap on the trumpet. Mark Rap on the trumpet. <laughs> Have y'all been enjoying your evening this evening? You had a good time? Yeah. Even if you knew the song you didn't, you had a good time. Yeah. That's called jazz music, baby. <laughs> we had a great time playing for y'all tonight. And we'd like to come back again. So you tell them here at the, at the house here, tell us, look, bring Mark and Wes back. All right? When you're going out, <laughs> tell them, we'd love to come back and play. Please look for these fine musicians on the bandstand. Let's get them out of sight. Out of sight. So I can thank you very much. Hopefully you get home very safely. Beware of the drivers. And if they're acting the fool like we say in New Orleans, you just slow down. Have a good evening. We'll see you the next time we're here. Thank you very much. Bye-bye. Thank <laughs> you.